I'm just going through, I'm sitting in uh, this dark corner in my studio because there's nothing here. And uh, just going through on my computer, uh, making some graphics for the behind the scenes of making the vlog. Um, 30 day challenge that I've now committed myself to doing. So uh, basically I'm going to be releasing a vlog uh, about how, to, how I'm making the vlog. Yeah. And also I'm going to bring some stuff up from the car now. Uh, but it's raining outside. It's, it's totally raining outside. And I didn't expect that. But it's raining. But... Yeah. The space, the wallpaper is, is coming together. Um, and that's nice. I'm happy about that. So... Yeah. Um, going to bring some stuff up from the car. Oh, it's really raining out there. And that's why, that's why sometimes you just have to do two, three, or even four takes. Because you come back in from the rain, carrying a nice cinema display, and you realize the camera wasn't rolling. Welcome to vlogging. So, now that I'm playing a bit of piano, just take your mind off things. I just moved the piano in here yesterday, it was real heavy. Um, and I uh, got the piano tuner coming down in a couple of weeks to do his or hers work on this Yamaha. I'm looking forward to it. It's a little bit out of tune right now. As you might be able to tell. So, somewhere between the house and bringing my stuff from the car and the house and the car and the house, I dropped my uh, ICOS um, on the ground in the rain, in a lake, in a puddle, but they're all wet now, so I thought it would be a good idea, that's so wet, so wet, thought it would be a good idea to try and see what happens when you put wet ICOS into your ICOS, this wasn't planned at all really, it's a, uh, <laughs> really, I turned the camera on and decided to do it. Does it blend? Here we go. Let's give it a try. I think it's gonna be all right, at least when it dries out. Anyway, eye costs, if they get a bit wet, you can still smoke them. Probably. I don't even know if this is going to work. Probably pointing right at the ground. And it's not even raining as hard. One of the things about vlogging is that when you're trying to capture like something like this, like driving in the rain, it's always at those times when you get green lights all the way. I never get green lights all the way on my way home, but one time when I want to set the camera and try and capture my drive home, I get green lights all the way. I don't get the chance to stop and place the camera and turn it on. Unbelievable. It's Murphy's Law at its best, you know. Anyway, I'm talking just in case I did manage to put, push the record button. And there. One of the things about driving in Japan in the rain is that you can't see the lines on the road. It's um, very difficult to know which lane you're in half the time. I just kind of look at the guy in front's lights and uh, follow them and hope nobody does like a cheeky little duck out like this taxi dude. Okay, we've got a red light. So yeah, I've just uh, finished cutting and I just wanted to film one more entry for today to finish it off and sign off and say see ya. Um, it's been such an eye-opener cutting this. I've uh, I feel quite embarrassed actually about re releasing this because uh, I'm pretty tired, I've been at work all day and I can see it and um, so well it is what it is and it's a 30 day challenge so I have to go through with it and 
I can honestly say that I learned a lot just from uh, doing this one day and uh, cutting it together. Um, already got some ideas of what works and what doesn't work. So yeah, it was really good experience. Uh, so I'll see you. I'll be blo uh, vl vlogging from tomorrow morning. So uh, I will see you in tomorrow's episode. Bye bye.